And if we take a step back here, you're a veteran of the Iraq War, and on Saturday, the country commemorated the 20th anniversary of 9-11. Do you believe that America is safer today than it was 20 years ago? And did our military involvement in Afghanistan and Iraq help or hurt that cause? There have certainly been some pretty dramatic improvements in terms of our intelligence collection capabilities, in terms of our uh, reorganization of our domestic security apparatus so that we'd be better prepared to deal with threats, to identify them, to mitigate them. Uh, we're far more effective at going after our adversaries. So there have been certainly some significant improvements. Now, where have we have seen that fall short? is if you look at the global ranks of individuals committed to violent terrorism, uh, they have certainly swelled since 9-11. Now, we were able to deny, at least temporarily, sanctuary for Al-Qaeda within Afghanistan, so that was certainly an added benefit of our involvement over there. But in the rapid rise and takeover of Afghanistan by the Taliban, that has been a rallying cry for extremist groups across the world who looked at this and said, we can achieve our goals. I mean, this is a monumental recruitment tool and legitimizing tool for those who seek to use violent means to push forth uh, an incredibly dangerous agenda, who seek to use the instruments of terrorism to accomplish their political goals. So I think it's hard to say that we are you know, safer in the world. Uh, we maybe have a more robust and competent homeland defense, uh, but this has certainly been a two-decade period that has seen some victories and plenty of failures.